Breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. At the Supreme Court today, a papa and his boys were thoroughly disgraced. The case dismissed and they were told to apologize to Labour Party. End of case. So this is what happened today and every single person can see. We all know what our papa has been up to and what he's been going about asking Peter Obi to stop the case, you know, and to do whatever he, he, he you know, he, it's been going on. So this is what is happening right about now, my lovely, wonderful people. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. What really happened? Today in Supreme Court, judgment, not be smutting, a final solution has come to light as Lemido Apapa, the proposed embittered Labour Party chairman, had his case dismissed by the courts and asked to apologize to Labour Party. Why Senator, why Senator Amacho remained the legitimate candidate for the Labour Party in Imo State and Abore remains the, the authentic Labour Party National Chairman. This is what happened today at the Supreme Court. The case has been ongoing. It happened at the High Court at the appeal, you know, at the appeal. And today they went to the Supreme Court trying to legitimize who the Supreme Court, um, uh, you know, legitimize who the chairman of, uh, you know, Labour Party is and everything that happened. And at the end of the day, here we are. Okay, the matter has been fully, you know, uh, decided, like you heard, end of story. Okay, end of story. So these are some of the things that have happened. And every single person is very much aware, okay, of all that has happened. And the truth of the matter is, until, you know, some of these issues are resolved and we get to the very bottom of it, we may not be able truly to ascertain. Okay, those who want to destroy the nation and doing everything humanly speaking possible to make sure that this country remains in their claws and in their hands. If we are going to be honest and sincere, if we are going to make sure that things do not remain the same way, every single individual will have to bring what they have to the table. Okay, and so we need to we need to ensure that we rise up to the occasion and we do all that we can. You see, Nigeria belongs to us, and with the current disposition of things, we all know that there are people who want to manipulate this, you know, the whole the whole situation in order to fit them, to give them what they think you know belongs to only them, and this is part of what has happened even right about now. So Nigerians wake up. It is the dawn of a new day. And um, regarding Labour Party, you know, these are some of the things that are, you know, that are right now going on. End of story. Um, a papa can now leave the party, Labour Party alone. He's the one who has vowed that, you know, Peter Obi will not get, um, in case, you know, Peter Obi does not win the cases that are in court now, especially at the um, uh, Supreme Court. He, uh, you know, he said he, he is sure and he has concluded that Peter Obi will not get you know, the ticket for Labour Party said because Peter Obi has caused a lot of problem for him. Peter Obi has not been listening. He told Peter Obi not to go to court anymore. Peter Obi still continued to pursue the case up to the Supreme Court. He said Peter Obi does not listen and all kinds and all, you know, but today uh, all that matter was laid to rest. You know, all that was laid to rest because it cannot be business as usual. As you and I can see, more has happened more than you can imagine. You know, our papa has been fighting the party, you know, and uh, today um, the Supreme Court has given, you know, the verdict on who the real uh, uh, candidate in Emu State is and all that is going on. So my lovely people, Nigeria election is no longer an election that can be done and dusted and people can move on. They must go to court and all the way to the Supreme Court because... INEC, I'm sorry to say, have not been carrying out their duties like they should. If you do something that people are totally, completely sure about, completely aware, okay, and, you know, there's no need for anyone to worry, nobody will worry. Everybody will be so rest assured and say, you know what, this is it, completely, totally done. You know, everybody will be rest assured. 
you know, but when you conduct an election and this election is already leading to all kinds of, you know, um, abnormalities, wake up my people, it calls for a renewed, uh, you know, a position where people must become vigilant and watch carefully. You know, it's sad that I make we conduct an election, Nigerians will not believe. And they have to continue to fight the case all the way up. How sad. Just how sad, you see. So these are some of the things that have happened. And it is important we pay attention and we get, you know, we, we get all that is needed to, to get to save us from the current disposition. Anyway, my lovely people, it is what it is. Today, it's all over. Uh, Papa, I, I believe, I want to believe we'll not disturb the party again as he's been shown the red card. And I want to believe he will, you know, he will do right by the people. He will not uh, fight, you know, Obi or the party anymore. I want to believe that, but you never know. So please leave us a comment. Don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Remember that the best time, you know, to speak out is now. Don't wait till tomorrow. Let's end every kind of, you know, oppression that have been, you know, that have been put on against the country, you know, and uh, let's, let's, let's speak against it and let's ensure that this nation move forward. There's, there's a lot going on already. There's a lot going on already, okay? The nation, people are tired of the same thing over and over again. Governorship election, there are all kinds of election. So long as INEC is involved, people are not happy. How sad. Honestly, sincerely speaking, how sad. You see, it, it's, it's, it's really a wake-up call. Sincerely, truly speaking, it's a wake-up call. Yes? Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Remember, we all must stand together and end everything and anything that does not look like what should be to move us forward. We have to end this and move this nation to a place of relevance and truth. You know, today mark a beginning of beginning for Labour Party, you know, where people are beginning to, you know, take a real position in terms of where they go from here. You know, so it is what it is. Remember that we are all in this together and we need to stand up together as one and end everything and anything that will not move, you know, Nigeria forward. You know, it is what it is. So my lovely, wonderful people, every one of us know that the nation, you know, with all that is going on, there is urgent and sincere need for everybody to rise up together as one. Okay, and end this so charade you know, of all that is going on right now. It is, it is a matter of an urgent call. Yes, it's a matter of urgent call. Bye for now.